With the rise of artificial intelligence, many, including several big players in the tech industry, are warning about the potential risks of the technology. But Microsoft founder Bill Gates, at the site of his newest company, is taking a different tact and claiming that AI isn't as scary as it seems. With her exclusive interview, here's ABC's Rebecca Jarvis. OpenAI CEO Sam Altman told me he's a little bit scared about this technology. Are you scared? We're all scared that a bad guy could grab it. The White House, the administration, regulators here in the U.S., do you think they're up to speed? Uh, not yet. They're not ready? Not yet. I mean, Why are they not ready? You're never going to have every politician understanding it, but how do you build up a capacity to, for health applications, for education, to review things. The government has a role to play here. You know, they won't be the experts, but they have to be part of that discussion. And so the White House starting those conversations, that's all good. Still, unlike others in the field, including Elon Musk, Gates opposes pausing AI development. If you just pause the good guys and you don't pause everyone else, you're probably hurting yourself. You definitely want the good guys to have strong AI. Can you guarantee that? If you stop the good guys, you can guarantee it won't happen. You've got a fake image of the Pope, fake images of President Joe Biden. At some point, if those proliferate at a much greater scale, won't that confuse people about what the truth is? You're going to have to say, where did this come from? And, and if, whose responsibility is that? Each, each the of reader, us? The reader, the viewer. Every person has the responsibility to question well, what they're so looking so at. Well, society is going to start to say, okay, this source is more of a trusted source. That was Rebecca Jarvis reporting. And just to put this in further context, Gates says only two pieces of technology have amazed him in his lifetime, the PC and chat GPT.